five, four, three, two, one. Still good. Shows the stage in the background. That's nice. So, Temizikani on Nagashimas. Tatakani Naruto Ikedo. I don't want to get crystal volume. Fuck. I'm just like five things already. Fuck. Alright. Uh, watch Aki run. So it looks like they kept Seifuku dash acceleration, but you know, they made it so she actually runs now. Not like she glides, but she just runs. Alright, pinwheel, double jump. Arkwood's already doing. Man, it's like. It's like they want people to use the fuck out of shield, and then people are gonna be like, oh, okay, cool, you use shield, I'm gonna punish you for doing shield because it has recovery, and if you don't shield something, you're boned. So, anyway. Air confirm, nice and easy, meaty 2 and 4. Oh, yeah, you can do late cancel. Late cancel and the moon drive. What does that pose? I wish her hair kind of like went red. The pose is nice though, I'm not gonna lie to you. The pose is nice. Yeah, I'm biased. That pose is nice. Wait. Hold on. Uh huh. Moon drive. That's a mid. Why can you low shield a mid? Unless that's a special move. No, that. Hmm, they change. Maybe they change how shields work. Yeah, they probably won't use use the fuck out of shield, so boy. Special move. You the thing is some special moves you cannot low shield, some you can. So may, maybe it's like that. Anyway. Confirm off the shield counter from the other shield. Ow. Wait. She's gonna run full screen. Uh-huh. Moon skill elbow? Yeah, she still has that. Confirm, yep. Forward throw. Alright, so that forward throw means that Arkwick can still get, uh, confirms off forward throw in the corner, which is very important. So yeah, that's, that's what people need to know about Arkwick. You still have that option to Gain meter, knock down, get damage off the throw. Throw is still strong for her. Hey, smelt your blood. We mashed to where? Woo! Uh, what's important here? Smash, charge 5B. You have a lot of time to do charge 5B. Air dash, air dash 2 and 4. Charge jump C. Falling jump. So the charge jump scene in this game doesn't look like it gives like the the knockdown where like you know if you get hit by a charge jump normal you get slammed to the ground. This you kind of just like eat more hit stun so you can get a rejump. All right, throw off of that pinwheel. Yeah, I guess if you don't use yeah if you don't use your air action again you get your jump and your air dash. So she does double jump jump A air dash yeah. But then Arc was like yeah I don't need to deal with this I have moon drive whatever. Sees a, the Aki sees the option, it's just like, alright, I'm just not gonna fucking do anything, I'm gonna wait for you to swing, I'm just gonna do air shield. Wait, she has jump to C? Oh, it's a shield counter. Oh, that's just jump C, okay, it's not jump to C, right, say Fuku doesn't have jump to C. Damn. Right. Yep, shield counter confirmed. She's dead, right? Wait, did you get the meter? Beforehand? Yeah, you, you didn't have the meter. Uh. That didn't scale as much as I thought it would, even before the arc drive. Like, you know, ignoring the fact that it's arc drive is going to do a lot of damage. The combo right after the shield counter is actually a lot of damage. So maybe they just kept damage high off, high on average for everybody, which is nice. Yeah, she's super dead. She's dead from the. She, she owes life in the next round. Hold on. 
<laughs> Use your meter. I fucking look at that pose. That pose is pretty good. She's just like, ah, I'm angry. Pinwheel, yep. People just doing air shields again. Wait. Uh, 2C, 5C, 5C, elbow, wall, bounce. Damn, you have a mad time to follow up. Air surrender, yep, that's fine. Air dash, wake up moon drive, that's whatever. You committed to a move, it got shielded. You can block because you, wait, what is that? Oh, okay. Yeah, because if you land close enough to the ground, it doesn't automatically, like, you don't get popped up. Because this jump scene hits really late. She's able to actually land and then block because the shield counter... Actually, she held it for a while. She didn't need to hold it for that long. If she did it immediately, it probably would hit, but because you waited... Wait, did it use up? Wait, can you only... Okay, so she does shield. And then she does the... The teleport out of the shield. Not the teleport, but the... The shield move? The shield follow-up? Yeah, shield follow-up, sorry. And it uses up a, a chunk of her moon drive. So maybe you can only do do this in moon drive. Yeah, maybe. It looks like it. Yeah, confirm with jump A. That's her DP. Oof. Rising jump A confirmed, yep, easy. Ah, uh, yes, more shielding. Tries to do Charge 5C. Charge 5C is probably unblockable in this game as well. So Aki is just like, I'm gonna shield that shit. Does the... Does the Vanish shield follow-up? So, I guess if you shield something and you do the Vanish follow-up, you just teleport to them, wherever they are. You got an extra bar until you saw Ark do that. <laughs> uh, up, shield counter, you press your shield counter. Air throw under. Nope. Skill bonus. <laughs> Where you're in the air, I'm gonna do DP Moon Drive. That's actually very good because it shows that you can do. If you have enough time, you can do fucking. You could do a move. You see the move hit. You do Moon Drive. Ooh, I think you can do it if it whips too. So that's still important because you just you want them to use it. But if it hits, you gotta confirm. Uh, 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 uh. Air throw, pinwheel, yep. Moon drive, pinwheel, wake up, moon drive. Yeah, she didn't commit to anything, so it's fine. You're just trying to see what's going on. Yeah, see? If you commit too early and they don't do anything, they're like, oh, you're going to press a button? It's it's just like uni. So, like, everyone who's saying, like, moon drive is going to be mad and annoying, it's like, it's just like uni. Everyone has warple constantly. That's, that's literally it. Everyone's going to have warple constantly, and you just have to figure out how you're going to use it. This is important. This is an important tool in the fucking game. Low shield, shield counter. Damn, she was just pressing special moves. That clashes? Why does that clash? Arc drive should be dead. Yeah, arc drives do a lot of damage in this game. Like, for real, for real. That pose is very good. That pose is very good. I need that pose. Alright, anyway. Can wheel? Ah, look at that. Someone's using their brain. I'm gonna do a pinwheel. Oh, that's pinwheel? Check this shit out. I'm gonna use shield. <laughs> Thank you for giving me the opportunity to do three different things. And then you're just like, what if I did nothing? I'm just gonna block this shit. And I'm just gonna swing on you because I landed first. It's not a punish, but you get the move after. That confirms that nice. Yep. You do the 2 2, I guess 2 2 C. Put the pinwheel on top. You're crouching, guess what? Uh, because you're crouching, you didn't block anything, the throw will still work on you. If she stood up to block the ring, the throw would not work. So, command throw. During the command throw, the ring hits. You gotta confirm. Is this unblockable? 
It's not unblockable. It's just that because she's crouching, she doesn't actually block the ring. If she stood up to block the ring, she would have to block the low. So the mix up here is that, okay, are they going to do dash up two way or are they going to do the command grab super or a normal grab? Normal grab will work here if you're crouching, but if you're standing, normal grab and command grab do not work. However, you can do a high low mix up that you get beat up by because the pinwheels on top of you. You have more stuff to think about. That's 200 IQ. Well, that works for every fighting game. Every fighting game, when you have like a projectile on top of you or something that's on top of you where you're not really blocking it, you're crouching. If you stand up, you don't get thrown. You have throw protection. However, you just make the mix up worse. Whereas if you crouch, you don't worry about you don't worry about added uh, mix up with it. You just have to worry about not getting thrown now. So if they do a high on you, you're like, okay, I'm gonna stand up and block. However, if you're just crouching, you're waiting for them to like do slow pressure on you. They can just throw you. Yeah, you're trading high low for strike throw. Or you're trading strike throw for high delay air dash high, uh, empty jump low. So like you have to think which is worse that you're just going to be like, I'll take this mix up as opposed to this mix up. That's how it works there. Just mash 2A and pray. I mean, no, no, you're supposed to mash moon drive if you have it. Oh, she doesn't have moon drive. Rip, rip. She's got a block. That's crazy. She's got a block. Will a, will a low profile the wheel? I don't know. It it could make your hurt box bigger. So if you press 2A here, there's a chance that she actually just might get hit because the blocking animation is she's it looks like she's in proxy uh, block because, you know, the big hurt box is there. And if you hold down back, the game is like, OK, you're close to this. So you're going to have to block this. Right. So you're going to have to be in this block animation. Whereas if you just mash 2A, there's a good chance that either you're short enough to not get hit by it or you're big enough when you press the button to get hit by it. It's one of those two. No, it doesn't need to be full. It needs to be at least half. If you don't have it at half, then you cannot pop moon drive all the time, which is everyone's concern. Like, oh, just pop moon drive all the time. And it's like, hey, how do you get moon drive? You get it by getting by shielding, getting hit and hitting somebody. There you go. <laughs> Yep, early throw back into the corner, doesn't use another jump, gets to do a meaty jump B. That can get shielded or reversaled, but it's usually just like, hey, if they're not doing any of that, this is a free meaty. <laughs> you could always mash, yeah, you could always mash. Oh, shields the block string, gets the follow-up blocks. Doesn't lose their turn, but they just give up space. Is that? Oh, wow, what? What the fuck? Was that charged? No, she just... Holy shit, that just fucking sends you flying. Also that pose, that pose is cute. Ugh, motherfucker is still doing jump shield. Oh, and then just landed and did a special move, okay. All right, you get a follow up, that's nice. So I guess when you do EX moves, depending if you use up all your wall bounces or not, wall and floor, floor bounces, you can do moon drive activation to get a confirm, to get a more solid confirm if you just did raw EX. BC, BC, B, B air throw. So, you know, she has triple jump because moon drive, moon drive gives her a triple jump, but she couldn't do jump C. It looks like her third jump is not as high. So she couldn't do BC, BC jump, BC jump, BC jump, or BC jump, BC jump, BC air throw. It looks like she can only do B air throw at the last sequence, but yeah, it, it is a lot. One, two. Uh, Watashi wa gamer desu? But yeah, you can see that, like, that's what the moon drive does for her. She gets another jump. <clears throat> Shielding gives life back. Yes, very little, though. Very little life. It's just something they added. I actually don't know how else this would affect gameplay, but it's something to think about for later. Yeah, and that's the other thing about doing Moon Drive. I'll wake up. So, Aki does reversal Moon Drive here. Tries to mash 2A. The Arkwood's like, alright, you're probably gonna mash like 2A or 3 or so. Guess I'm just gonna fucking do Moon Skill Dive Kick or Dive Claw. Still in Arkwood still has Moon Drive available, so she could do that sequence again. 
Lock the overhead. That wreck is an overhead. That last part of the wreck is overhead. You have to stand up to block. Does EX elbow? Oh, tried to DP and it got. Wait. Why did the DP lose to charge jump C? That was DP, right? Yeah, that's DP. That's moon skill DP. Yes, that's moon skill DP. Does it not have invul? Is charge jump C just brolic? Uh, I have questions. I actually have a lot of questions about that. But I guess I'll figure it out when we get the game because that's kind of wild. Does it? Wait, it doesn't have invul. That's right. Because if it had invul, it would say it would say it over here. Yeah, it's supposed to be combo. So yeah, because if if a move has invul, it will say it here. It will tell you if it has invul. So it doesn't have invul. That's hilarious, actually. So I guess it's a combo tool. Oh, she got bopped. Oh, you're dead. Oh, low air dash to the ground, time to guess. Wait. Did you? Oh, you're not a moon drive, so you did air dash, double jump, jump C. You better stand up, girl. Oh, you did charge jump C. Oh, you didn't stand up. Rip, you're dead. Okay, alright. Yeah, why is she crouching? That jump C was coming in at her from like forever away. What the fuck? Who taught her how to play Melty Blood? She crouched the high, yeah, that's crazy. Yeah, the music the music on that stage was getting it was getting like way better as uh it progressed. So the fear that everybody had that the music wouldn't be a bop is uh more or less debunked. <laughs> 